Hello, it's Nashi, the Conservative Gamer, back again. We got today the end of the vanilla leatherworking with rugged leather, or skinning rather again. L rugged leather. This is where, this is, I don't even need to do another area. This is where you want to farm rugged leather 100%. You can do about 10 runs of these in, in less than an hour. It takes about 45 minutes. And you get close to 500, 600 rugged leather, which is more than enough for what you need generally. Uh, so this is by far, hands down, AQ20, the best place to farm rugged leather. So what you do is, if you don't know which one to go into, it's this first left one right here. This is where you want to go. And you go in here, and I'll show you the route once we get in here. So we are inside the instance, and what you can do is you get to skin most of these kind of bug things. So the route that you want to take uh, is, this is the beginning of the instance up here, is you want to kind of go around and just clear this first room. Uh, you can clear around the boss. Make sure you don't pull the boss by accident. If you pull the boss by accident, just run out of the instance. You can get really good at it by avoiding them. So obviously the higher level the better. You can do this basically at 80 plus. Uh, so you do, you know, damage where you actually farm stuff. You do have a chance as well to get good drops in here. There are good slut mog drops. There are good some other transmog drops that even you might want. So that's another benefit of doing this. Now, you, you want to clear this first room. Fight them all here, and then you want to go around here, and then this is the next section right here. You can basically, you get everyone right here on this edge, then you go through here, clear everyone in this room, and boom. So I'll go ahead and start uh, pulling everything here. Um, some of it's hard to get uh, in the beginning because they knock you up and stuff like that, but I just use my uh, totems on my monk. Um, that helps out a lot. Um... You know, if you got a demon hunter and stuff like that. So I'm just going to pull all everything over to here. And what a bam. What well, bam. Okay, so make sure your bags are empty before you come in here. Because obviously you got to loot. And then you just skin away. Yeah, so this is one of the few places um, in vanilla classic WoW areas. Where when you skin something, you get multiple leathers. And that is the big advantage here. Um, so as you can see, I'm getting two to three rugged leathers every time. Never a single one. And, uh, you know, if you only need a couple hundred, you don't even need to do the whole route. You can just literally do this first section room. Just make sure you don't kill the boss. It's very important. Very important that you don't kill the boss. So basically... Uh, we basically did the first room. Now there are there is some extra over here, and uh, you can pull these things. But here's the boss. Make sure you don't pull him by accident. But all these little scorpid guys, they all uh, they all can be skinned. And uh, as you can see, I mean, I literally just you know, it took me what like less than a minute, and I got 33 rugged leather. So you can do this 10 times if you just need a couple hundred for all your crafts or to power level your classic leather working you know whatever you want to use it for making transmog stuff like that this is by far the best place to do it now there is a place outside of an instance where if you just need a couple and there's a portal to it directly from dalaran or from ogremire and i'm sure probably one from uh, stormwind or uh, whatever but it's it's by where the dark portal is uh, whoops. Uh, basically, you can go here, and you want to talk to the person up here at the top. Zadorm... Zadormi? Zadormi. You want to talk to Zadormi, look at the old school kind of vanilla Badlands, you know, pre... I guess Cataclysm is what it, what it would have been. But basically, you want to make sure that right around here, if you just, like, farm around this area, there are hyenas, boars, um... There are like ash main boars, I think is what they're called, and then snicker something hyenas, and uh, and then obviously fell hounds from around here. And you need the old dark portal to do that, not the new one uh, uh, from. Oh, it's it was Wad, it was Wad. So not the new one from Wad. You need the old ones. 
that were out uh, in the original Dark Portal area. And that's the best place to farm them outside the instance, but please, if you just need a couple hundred, just come here and do this. It's super duper easy. Super duper easy. It's unbelievably easy. So next we'll be on to uh, the very first BC skins, and uh, we'll be doing some BC map farming as well. Also, keep an eye out for the mining and herbalism videos. Uh, for most of the classic herbs, we're going to do probably duo farms. Um, so the videos will be like a couple of, uh, maybe two, because most of the classic areas have two good herbs in them. But we might separate them up as well. Tell me how you like my new little boar, uh, webcam border here. I just finished making it. I'm going to upgrade it as soon as I learn a little bit more After Effects. It is kind of fun learning how to do this kind of stuff, and I really appreciate all your support. Please don't forget to comment, like, subscribe uh, for more uh, WoW farming content, and we will be back with some not hide leather farming. Until then, have a great one, guys. Thanks so much for watching me, Nashi, the conservative gamer. I really appreciate it. Have a great one. Peace.